Hey Scrappers, it's Tom from the iScrap app and we want to answer a Scrapper question that has been asked for years and hopefully we can finally put it to rest. Should I take my scrap copper, melt it down on my own and make it into ingot form? Now our immediate reaction is absolutely not and we want to tell you some of the reasons why. Now you might have brand new pieces of copper that you stripped and you look and you go, wow that's bright and shiny, I want to make this into a bar so I can have it more condensed, sell it to the scrapyard at a higher price, this way I can make more money. Well that's a really good concept but let me tell you some of the problems that scrapyards see that will hopefully discourage you from doing this. When I see this wire, I can see through it, I can see the end, I can see around it, so it leaves very few questions. When I see an ingot in an ingot form, I don't know what's inside of it, I don't know how it was melted, I don't know how much dirt there was, maybe there's water inside, maybe it was mixed with steel, maybe there was tin coated copper that was mixed in it, maybe there's some aluminum, but maybe it changed its form, its shape, its quality. Those are a lot of the things that scrapyards look for when they see ingots coming in the door and even when ingots come in stamped when they're either rejects from manufacturers or obsolete inventory, almost every single scrapyard owner I've ever talked to cuts those ingots in half two to three different times to make sure that they're uniform throughout by analyzing them with their XRF. Now this might not be the answer that you want to hear as a scrapper because making ingots not only is it cool, it looks really neat and it gets you something to do on the weekends, but think twice before you do it because you could be losing money at your scrapyards. Any other questions on ingots, transforming your scrap into different shapes, please let the team here at iScrap know and we'll get you those answers as soon as we can. Until next time scrappers, I'll scrap you later.